it's Stacy and I'm here to actually film my very first video for my new beauty product channel. So today I am bringing you what was supposed to be a first impression and I had forgotten to turn my mic on. Yeah, so I recorded this already and it had no sound because I'm an idiot. So, okay, my first impressions is going to be of the It Cosmetics Celebration Foundation. And please ignore any nastiness on my nails because they're not looking very good right now. I'm sorry, I should have redone them. Anyway, um, so this is the foundation. This is, I got the Celebration Foundation in light medium. And I got it, it is available at Ulta. I know, but I got it at QVC. The reason being, um, I paid with shipping $49. Let's round that up to 50. It was 49 and something. Um, and then there was tax. For both the foundation and the brush. Now, if you were to buy these separately at Ulta, the foundation is 35 and the brush is 48. So that's a total of $83 um, versus the 50 from QVC. So you save about $33. And going forward, it doesn't make sense. Sorry, my dog is annoying my cat. He's a special guy. He doesn't learn. Um, anyway, it doesn't make sense to keep ordering a new brush if you don't need it every time. But I think if you're going for it Cosmetics Foundation the first time, it's a good deal on QVC. And my plan is just to get it from Ulta afterwards if I like it. So um, I've already opened this and already used it once, but there is the shade. That's light medium. And hopefully, I think it's coming off a little yellow on camera. It's a little bit more pinky um, beige but it comes with a compact with a mirror, which I'm covering, obviously. And then underneath, you get a sponge. But since I got the brush with it, I'm gonna be using the brush today. And I've already put on my pre-foundation, I've done my pre-foundation routine with um, moisturizer, sunscreen, um, primer. So I am going, to just go ahead and put this foundation on I'll let you guys see what kind of coverage it has I'm gonna put it on this half of my face my right your left um, and then we can do a comparison because um, you can see how well it'll cover up unfortunately I have some blemishes going on right now the so first things first I always put like to put my hair back in a tie when they do my foundation so I can see all of the skin I need to cover and my hair doesn't get in my makeup so I'm gonna just do the um, swirl tap and bluff I think we all know that one and here's the brush with the product on it that's the brush it's co it cosmetics. Um, all right, here we go. So I guess here's where I pretend to be surprised. And, ooh, look at that coverage. Ooh, even though I already knew this was going to happen because I already tried it. So oh, all of media is just one big lie. Might as well get used to it. And you can see I have like some significant freckles up here and um, obviously blemishes over here that, you know, I might want to go back over and my chin is really red right now because I'm having a bit of an allergic reaction. Well, hypersensitivity. Um, anyway, and I've got some eczema going on on my chest, which is fun. Let's just zoom in a little bit. And hopefully. 
hopefully you can see all of my imperfections and see how they have been kind of blurred out. Oh, nice, camera, go out of focus. So you can see, I think, a difference. Okay, let me zoom out again, and I'm just gonna go and finish putting on. And while I'm doing this, I might as well talk about the packaging because I did that in my first video and then I just forgot this time because, you know, when you're doing something again, you're like, did I already do that? No, maybe I did. I don't know. Okay, so ooh, I think that is a nice level of coverage. Um, but anyway, the packaging. It feels like NARS. It's a plastic, but it's got that kind of like slightly satiny, rubbery, but not rubbery, just satiny finish. Um, which unfortunately will pick up powder like nobody's business if you know NARS. And the brush handle has the same thing. So this is the Heavenly Luke's Flat Top Buffing Foundation Brush. Um, as far as I can tell, there's just the one and it looks like it but um i really like this brush it's super soft oh, it's so soft and it just buffs right in oh my goodness normally i have issues with a lot of brushes um my skin's really sensitive and sometimes they hurt <laughs> which sucks um but this one is just like so teddy bearish. Like I just want to snuggle with it. So that's a pretty significant level of coverage, I think. Um, would I bother with concealer? Probably, maybe. And here, and here, and here. Um, but in general, that's pretty good coverage. So I'm just gonna go and finish the rest of my makeup so that you can see the all together look and design. Or no, not design. Does it make any sense? Anyway, I'm just gonna do my eyes and my lips and whatnot real quick. And I will be back. Okay, so here's my final look. Um, just, so IT Cosmetics, it's by Jamie Kern, and this foundation, specifically full coverage anti-aging foundation with hydrolyzed collagen, peptides, and drops of light technology. I don't know how you put drops of light in a powder, but Directions. I probably should have read these for it, but yeah. <clears throat> Using the IT Cosmetics Heavenly Luxe Buffing Airbrush Foundation Brush or Enclosed Sponge, swirl circles in the powder and dust onto your skin in circular motions for naturally flawless, soft focus, skin perfecting finish. Flawless, not 100%. I mean, I got, you know, a little bit, but um, hey. It was much better than what I started with. Small amount of this Ultra Luxe Full Coverage Foundation goes a long way. Yeah, buildable for desired amount of coverage. Um, yeah. Um, it is talc free and paraben free, cruelty free, no animal testing. You've got the little bunny certified. Um, so, and made in the USA. So, you know, I'm gonna do a wear test and see how long this holds up. I'm not gonna do that until tomorrow because it's kind of late in the day. And, uh, thank you for joining me on my first journey and I hope it wasn't too awful. I mean, I plan to, I have a lot of things in my head and written down that I wanna get into, um, and make videos for so I'm really excited about this and if you like what you've seen so far please subscribe and like 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 like, like. please like like me it's 
a little desperate, isn't it? Okay. Anyway, um, subscribe, like, and I will be back with more information for you. Um, and I hope that you will join me on my journey to become a better beauty consumer. And hopefully together we'll become pretty smart. Thanks, bye.